Hey everybody, Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. Well, it's about 9.50 Thursday morning, 9.50 a.m. And it is turning out to be an absolutely gorgeous, gorgeous day here at Vanderbilt Beach in North Naples. It is partly cloudy here, but the clouds are so thin, they're not doing much in the way of stopping our beautiful Florida sunshine. It is gorgeous. And look at that water. That water is 80 degrees. 80 degrees, no red tide. Looking good. We get nice and warm here today. Temperature is in the 90s, maybe 95 in Lehigh Acres today. That's getting warm. Very, very shallow right in here. Shallow, beautiful. That water feels so good. Feels good, looks good. Just amazing. Too bad you're not here to dip your toes in it with me. That's Del Norwegian's Pass State Park up there. This is the north end of Vanderbilt Beach. I hope you enjoy these live feeds, these beach walks. I hope to someday see you here. That would be fun. any of our dolphin friends this morning haven't seen them lately during our morning walks but they are here I get reports from other people that they're seeing them out here they're just avoiding me for some reason This is not going to be too long of a beach walk, maybe down to La Playa. I did. This is actually my third live feed here, as far as my beach walk live feeds go. It's actually my fifth live feed this morning, if you count my little sound check when we first get out here, and then my YouTube video, my YouTube live feed. So it's a be live feed number five out here. Did see some awesome colors in my sound check. Go back and check that out. And a full moon. Very cool. Got a pretty good look at the moon this morning with the old iPhone during that live feed. That's right, boys. This morning I wish I was a Woo, it's getting windy. Wind's coming out of the east and it's blowing. This morning I wish I was at Wiggins Pass. Boy, those mornings were just incredible. Did you see that video I shared by the way yesterday of that sunrise? Oh. It was unbelievable. The, everything turned orange. The camera couldn't figure out what colors things were was having such a hard time adjusting to the colors. The colors were just out of this world. They were heavenly, <laughs> heavenly colors. I think that's the most explosive sunrise video that I've recorded at Delano Wiggins over the years. I was up at Wiggins Pass.
these colors here are just breathtaking. getting harder to walk here now with the tide coming in getting pushed up into some soft soft mushy sand that you sink down into when it's a low tide that's the best walk and the sand's nice and hard along the edge of the water really get a workout when you got to walk in the soft stuff morning. Uh, this is when I start pooping out. I walk back down the beach. The old legs start getting tired. The beach looks like it's just gets longer and longer every time I look up. They send some stars on Facebook if you're enjoying the view. Get a penny for each star. Could you not be liking this view? Just 
incredible. That wind is really picking up. That's when I walk home, I'm going to be walking right into that wind. I'm going to have to turn my hat around or hold on to it. Hold on to my head. Don't want that blowing away. You know you wish you were standing in that water right there, just walking along the edge. You know it. I know you wish you were. There's that one umbrella. We saw that the other day out here. Any luck today? Yeah, I just had a pompano. You had a pompano? Yeah. Awesome. Good size one or? Really? Th did you throw back? Yep. Man, it's beautiful out here. I was uh, not expecting it to be. The, I thought it was going to be a little cloudier today when I saw that early morning forecast. Got to have shrimp, though. Got to have your shrimp. Where's all your little white feathered friends that hang around the bait bucket? <laughs> <laughs> oh, have a wonderful day. So we got a pumpano a little while ago. Pretty nice size one. There are pompano running. Snook pompano. I don't know what else along the shore here. Morning. Yeah, I must not speak English. We do get a lot of folks from other countries here. A lot of Europeans. German. A lot of Germans. Naples is an international town. We actually did have a season this winter. Didn't know what to expect with the hurricane, but businesses did do some business, still doing some business. They're starting to slow down, I think, a little bit. Things are starting to slow down. Usually around Mother's Day, around the end of stone crab season, that's one season pretty much officially is over here. Things really quiet down, but it seems like each each summer gets a little busier. Probably some people are going to make up for vacations that they didn't get during the winter and come down here. We are coming back here. We are recovering all of southwest Florida, of course, up to the north of us. Bonita Beach, Fort Myers Beach. It's going to take them a while longer. Sanibel Island, they got hit really bad by Hurricane Ian. If you haven't been there, if you've been there and you haven't been back since the hurricane, you're going to 
you notice the difference, trust me. Oh, it looks like a whole different place. First thing you're gonna notice is just the lack of vegetation. Couldn't ask for a more awesome group of friends here than I got on Southwest Florida television. Y'all went all out yesterday with Papa and prayers. Man, thank you for that. Thank you, thank you. That made Papa really feel special. We love you, Papa. Here comes some of those clouds. These are real clouds. Some little white puffies. I like those kind of clouds. I think they're beautiful. It's that blue sky. I'm thinking about Papa. I hope he's okay this morning. I haven't known Papa very long, but what do I know of him? I love. He's quite the man and quite the character. God bless his soul. battery warning here. Oh boy. I figured that was going to happen right around the La Playa. Yeah, there's some clouds. There's some shadows for rolling through. Not big clouds. I just say they're just little little fellers. As Papa would say, they're just little fellers for now, but they might turn into bigger fellers as the day progresses. some shade some shade 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 all right I can't even see if anybody sent any stars if you did thank you I appreciate that remember tips hugely appreciated you can find a link to my PayPal account in the description of this post you can also find me on Venmo and Apple Pay Every dollar counts, my friends. Every dollar counts. Got to get up here past La Playa to get some of that shade so I can wrap up the live feed. Umbrellas out. They need those umbrellas now. Man, it is warming up. Big time. Big time warming up. It'll be busy probably down at the south end of the beach. It'll be busy everywhere at the beach. All right. 
right. Down here a little, a little further. Get up close to one of the buildings. One of the condos. Ooh, listen to that wind. Boy. It's shifting around to coming out of the southeast. Just looking up to the north there. Beautiful. Well, that wind's giving the gimbal a run for its money. This beach has really changed shape. See all these little indentations? All right, there's my, there's my destination. This big block of shade here. <laughs> so I can see the screen. Awesome. Got the sand's on. Wearing me out. Woo! Between the wind and the sand. All right, my friends, thanks for hanging out with me. I'm going to call it a morning here. I've got a couple photos and short videos to share later. So do check back periodically. Anything that you like, give it a like and a share. Hey, thanks for being a friend. Until next time, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay strong. Tally-ho, everyone. Tally-ho. For Southwest Florida Television, I'm Rob Stan. God bless.